uh, Kurt back here again and uh, we've got the equipment on board and uh, Bismarck out of all the boats I have has battery wise has the least amount of uh, power supply to it uh, we've got the two 6 volt seal lead assets each one is 6 volts uh, 12 amps uh, which gives her 24 amps of uh, power we have the uh, 16 ounce CO2 bottle and the pressure regulator hooked up to it and that's it, the receiver's in, the battery's in this place. I don't have the uh, battery connectors hooked up. I just wanted to give you guys a look inside this combat model. This plastic here is armor. This is what protects the insides from stray BBs from coming through and damaging the equipment. Really not a lot to it. This setup has been like this since I've had the ship. I've had uh, seven ounce bottles here. I've had uh, 12 volt battery here and two smaller six volts for the pump. Basically the layout has been identical. I've had sealed radio control boxes here. Uh, this one's unsealed. It's drilled out on the bottom so water just comes in easily but it could also go out easily when I pick up the boat so no standing water is in the box. All the servos are waterproof against uh, immersion in water. Uh, the pump stays exactly where it is. Uh, there's a, a two pound diving weight here uh, to uh, ballast it out. And uh, the only other change really significantly is that the superstructure that I replaced in 2010, 2009, 2010, which is this one here, is heavier and more dense than the original superstructure, which was a lighter high density foam. This one is much heavier. It was actually meant for my turpets hull I decided to refit Bismarck and use this superstructure. And this one definitely will bounce BBs off of it. Uh, <laughs> that's what it was intended purpose. It was supposed to be put into combat. But I decided to dress it up. So there you go. Uh, now we're going to put the hatches on. And uh, minus the ammunition we're going and the uh, CO2 because the bottle is devoid of CO2 right now. Uh, but this should be about a 2.53 pound bottle. Uh, but other than that though, we're going to weigh the model and uh, see where she sits at.